Hi, my name is Diana and I'm from BloomsByTheBox.com and today I'm going to show you guys how to make a ranunculus boutonniere. Um, we're kind of fixating on a, the garden theme that's going to be so popular this year, so if you want to learn how to make this centerpiece, you can see it in another video. Um, but to go with that, you know, you're going to need to do the boutonnieres and bouquets, so um, here's just a great simple boutonniere uh, that kind of looks kind of garden edgy. So we have a little bit of a, um, Italian ruscus, a little sprig at the top, uh, a little piece of the berries from seeded eucalyptus. We have um, a little bit of myrtle, just the very tip of it, one uh, white ranunculus, and some peach hypericum berries. And we trimmed it down a little bit because you don't want to overpower the look, so you only want to have a couple berries. First you're going to take your Italian ruscus and you're going to use this as the very back of the boutonniere and then you're going to add the piece of myrtle in front of it as a layer of greenery just to add some more interest. Next you can take some of your seeded eucalyptus berries and also place that in front. Now before we go ahead and secure the ranunculus, we're just going to actually secure these these three together. So I just uh, ripped a little piece of the floral tape and I'm just going to wrap it around these pieces. And floral tape actually sticks to itself when it's pulled tight so you won't have a problem just attaching these together and then you can just rip it until you're ready to add to the next piece. So here you go, you have the backgrounder of the boutonniere. Then you're going to take your stem of ranunculus and add it right to the front. Go ahead and using your floral tape, attach the ranunculus. It's good to attach each thing as you go and that way you're not struggling to hold pieces together the whole time because sometimes that can get pretty tough. And this way it'll also be much tighter when you're finished with it. So here we go, these are all attached. Now you're probably thinking that it needs a little something more. So although we have all of our greenery, we're gonna go ahead and attach just a little bit of peach hypericum berries. So I'm just going to take a little piece of floral foam, I'm sorry, floral tape, I'm going to put it right at the base of the ranunculus and I'm going to wrap it. Once again, pulling tight. Now the great thing about floral tape is that it's flexible. So once you're done doing all the wrapping, you can kind of rearrange things in the way you'd like them to look and it will still stick. So here I'm just kind of spreading out all these parts to make it balanced. Okay. The next step is to take your scissors and cut the bottom right straight across. You can just add one more piece of floral tape so that the bottom is not left open. Like that. And then another suggestion is you can add ribbon, burlap, uh, any type of material that you'd like in order to make the finishing touches and uh, correspond with your theme. And then you can go ahead and place the boutonniere on the men in your wedding party.